Hello lovely people, welcome to the Geek of It, I am Penge and welcome to The Great Beyond. So The Great Beyond is a tower defence, real-time strategy, base management game. We are going to build a base under the ground because I assume we're on an alien world, it's not really clear, but I'm assuming we're on an alien world because we can't go onto the surface during the daytime. But the objective of the game is to keep our space rocket safe. So we have an escape rocket, but it's sticking out of the ground. It's not underground, it's kind of poking out. And at night time, the aliens come down and they shoot at the rocket. And we have to defend the rocket using various defenses and soldiers and that kind of stuff. But to uh, get the soldiers in, we have to support them with a base and we have to have gold and mining and doctors and food and all that kind of stuff. So yes, it's very, very good. We shall go and have a look at it very shortly, but it's free. It's free on itch.io if you want to go and have a look. A link to the game, to the itch.io game page is in the description of this video. And you can see here, so Michael uh, Barrigo, Barrigo, possibly, I don't know how to pronounce that. I'm very sorry, I've probably done it wrong. But uh, yeah, he has used all these free assets. So, you know, free rocket and explosion assets and sounds and music and stuff, which is fabulous. I like that. That's very, very good. So let's go in. Let's take a look at the game. So we want to go to a new game. Don't want to be called Player One. Let's have Penge. I've done the tutorial. I've done the tutorial, I've learned the basics of the game. I did okay, I think. So um, easy's probably not much of a challenge. Let's go to medium, shall we? Let's go to medium and start a new game. So let's play the game. It takes us straight in and that's it there. So at the minute we're gonna pause it. Space is pause. It's already onto a winner. It's already a good thing. So there is our rocket. There is our space rocket sticking out onto the surface. We want to build uh, around here. We want to build under the ground. Under the ground is where we are going to live. Now these bits here we can't uh, sort of mine through, we can't sort of dig through these solid sort of grey blocks. Everything else we can dig through, but we will find lots of these underground. So we don't know where these are until we actually dig, a, dig out a square and find one next to us. Here is what we can build. So we can build reactors and we can build quarters and toilets and parks and all sorts of different things. There's power. Uh, everything is done in gold, so we have to dig out the gold just here in these particular little blocks. Uh, so yeah, there's no sort of mining for... Uh, specific materials so you don't need to look for aluminium to build you know a, a hospital and iron to build a I don't know, training room or whatever it's all done in gold which makes it nice and simple we've got 18 days we have to survive 18 days against the onslaught of the aliens and here is the uh, sort of day counter so this is the sun this is the morning it will move along here during the course of the day it'll get to here then it becomes night time Everything goes dark, aliens come down, they start shooting at this, this has hit points. If this uh, goes to zero hit points, I assume it explodes. I didn't actually get to that point when I was playing through it, if you can believe that. But um, I assume it explodes and we lose. So there we go. It's relatively simple, really. We just sort of plonk these rooms down and build a base. So we've got to start. So we need power. We have no power at all. There is no power. Now the only thing is, we could build over here. Because already here, you can see it says reactor. Gold, 2,000. It's going to cost us 2,000 of our gold. Gives us 20 power. It generates electricity, but has a negative local aura impact. So already, we've got into the concept of the fact that this will create a sort of bad aura around it. And around it on that floor, to the left and the right, it has a sort of red zone. And if you build quarters in there, if you build quarters next to reactor... The, the people who live in the quarters don't like it and their happiness goes down because there's happiness levels as well and there's hunger levels and cleanliness levels and lots of different things involved and you wouldn't think it looking at it but yeah there's quite a lot going on I mean there's toilets that's got a negative local or impact because would you li want to live next to the toilets <laughs> underground I don't think you would so let's put a reactor in we need a reactor to go in and when I think yeah we can fit four in over there because we can't drill through this we can't burrow through this stuff here so we can never go any further that way. So we might as well just put four reactors over there. Not now, we'll obviously add them as we need them. But we can just pop a reactor in right now. And they can just sit in that corner and merrily just power the base for a little while. That's absolutely fine. I like that. So uh, yes, to dig, we just can do that. We just draw the line. We sort of draw on it. We drag on the, on where we want to dig. And it highlights it. And it's fine to undo it. You just, you just click again. It's lovely and simple. It's very, very nice. So now we need some people to actually do some digging. So we need to place down a quarter. So it says 450 power minus, uh, oh no, sorry, gold 450 power minus two provides a home for one worker, build in positive aura areas. So let's build a couple of those just there, like that. That's going to say there's no power. I think it's just going to need to move time on a tiny fraction. Okay, now we can hire people. So there's miners, they go through and tunnel through the rock. Cleaners, obviously go around and clean stuff, and that's an important thing. Chefs prepare food. Doctors heal people up, and soldiers actually do the fighting on the surface. So really, before the end of day one, before the end of day one, and it's, it's challenging, it's a hard game, I think, particularly, we're going to need a doctor and some soldiers, I think. 
Now the uh, the soldiers go to the surface and fight. You can put little sort of base sort of turret things down, kind of like towers, I suppose. Uh, and if there's one of those, the soldiers go and sit in that, presumably because they're more defended, and they can fire from it at the aliens. The aliens come down a little bit Space Invaders-esque in a way. They kind of fly across and we shoot at them. Um, but when the soldiers get injured, they will go to a doctor. If they get injured to a certain point, they'll come down here and look for a doctor. So really, we want a doctor nearby on these floors. We don't want them to be too far away. If the doctor's over here somewhere, and the soldiers get injured, they're going to have to go da -da 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 -da, down these ladders, down a series of ladders and stuff, and over here, which is a little bit annoying. We don't really want that. But right now, we need miners. We need them to dig through the rock, because the minute we can't do anything. So let's get them to dig out all of that. That should be fine. And then, well, let's pop a ladder at the end. Pop a ladder just there, so they can get up. So people can get up onto that floor, and we'll see what happens. And look, they go through here. And it's very, very cool. The people are little yellow dots. So the miners are tiny little yellow dots. I think the doctors are white dots, if I remember rightly, which kind of makes sense, kind of clinical. The soldiers are red. Can't remember what colour the cleaners are. Green, possibly. I can't remember. But, you know, there, there's different colours of people. So it, it's very, very cool. I like that. Okay, now the, this guy here, Mr. Mr. Person here, the miner just here, has dug this tile out and has found that these two squares here are blocked. So we can't dig into those. So already we've got a bit of a blocker underneath it, which is not ideal. It's lovely if you have a big block like this underneath you. But no, never mind. Um, and it's got this thing here because it's now inaccessible. As far as this person is concerned, they can't get out. So they can go down a floor, they can drop down and start digging, but they can't get back up again. Now the, um, the thing is here, there's a ladder over there. I've instructed them to build a ladder just there. But um, yeah, for some reason they've decided to dig downwards. I don't quite know why they've come down first. But um, okay, no, that's fine. I mean, they, they have done, and that's the way of things. I can't really complain too much. So on this floor, we want to get a doctor's in. So let's drop another quarters in, like so. Let's get ourselves another miner, because we need to do more digging. Do you know what? In fact, let's get another miner. Let's get four miners in, because it's important. We need to get all this stuff dug out. And already, we're halfway through. We've got no soldiers. We've got no soldiers anywhere, which is bad, because that means that... The, um, the aliens have just got free reign. They can just shoot at us all they like, and that's generally bad. So right now, let's put a tower foundation upon the surface. So it's 250 gold, minus two power, which is absolutely fine, and it goes onto the surface. Well, let's put one there next to our rocket, and if we click on it, we can choose what we want. Now, radar tower we do want, not right now, but we'll get a radar tower at some point in the future. We can have a blaster, so a bullet blaster, shoots small bullets in five directions at medium speed. A shocker, shoots electricity that slows down targets. That's quite useful. A bomber shoots powerful bombs at a slow speed. A griller, we're getting into quite expensive stuff. It rapidly shoots fireballs. And a ray, which is a massive expense. It's 12 grand, so we can't go for one of those. I think the thing we might do now, go for a blaster, a blaster and a shocker, possibly. Maybe we'll have two at the top. So let's have that as a blaster. And let's put another one of those down, say, there. And that one can be a shocker. So that might be able to slow people down. There we go. That's splendid. They've dug some of this stuff out. There's a ladder over there. They can now use the ladder to get up onto the other floors. Okay. Dig some more of this out, please. Wouldn't mind having this floor done as well. And I bet that goes all the way down. I bet that goes all the way down in an annoying way. Right, let's take a look at what else we've got. Uh, yeah, I think you can sort of tell what's going to happen. You follow the line. So I bet that bit's going to be full of non-buildable stuff. All the way down here is not going to be buildable, I bet. It's going to be a little sort of corridor down to there. Oh, look at that. That is a hearty source of income there. And these things over here, this stuff over here, the gold stuff, is gold. And you dig it out and you get the gold and the tile is cleared. These here are presumably gems or diamonds or something shiny. It's pretty shiny things. And uh, yes, they you can dig them. They take a little bit longer. You get gold out of them, but they never disappear. So they're always there. They're a permanent fixture. So eventually we're going to have to get over there at some point and start digging those out to get a permanent source of gold. But that looks very, very tempting, doesn't it? Just dig through all that. Just absolutely just dig through all that. Yeah, I'd be rich. I'd just be able to build whatever I liked. I could just go, yeah, I built all the things. It's fine. Um, let's not dig that tile out, because that's a bit silly. Um, okay, so that's looking good. Now, reactor is okay at the minute. We don't need to buy another reactor. That's a good thing. Okay, this floor here, then. The floor that we've just created. Let's put on here... A hospital. So let's drop a hospital just there, like so. And then next door to the hospital, let's click to there. Uh, oh, power. 
We're a bit low on power. This is not good. Right, hang on. Can we speed time on? Oh, there we go. It's only because it was paused. Right. So in here, we want to hire ourselves a doctor. So it's 1,000 to hire a doctor. But okay, let's do that. So we're going to hire a doctor and he can work in the hospital. That's a good thing. Now we're going to get some more gold from this, which is lovely. We need more gold. We need more gold. Because now we need to get soldiers. We need to get ourselves some soldiers. Because at the minute... We've got defences on the top, but no one to actually man them. Nobody's doing anything with those defences, which is a bit useless. So we could put a soldier thing there. That'd be quite good. Maybe we could go soldier, 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 all the way down the middle there. Can we have one, two, three? Can we do that? Right, we're going to run out of power with that particular option. Slap another generator in. Lovely, thank you. So our power goes back up. And now we can get ourselves a soldier. So it's cost 450 to hire one soldier. Now these guys are still digging out gold, which is which is very good because we're going to need it. So they're still digging away. Yep, lovely. Right, so we get some more gold, hire another soldier. Uh, and on this here, we've got a gap here. I'm going to put a park. Increases the aura within two squares on both sides. A park dome. I like that. You don't see what's inside, but just drop a park in. So this uh, room here... This soldier's little sort of barracks, his little room, if you like, um, is is a bit happier. He's going to be happy in there because he's got a nice thing. He's got a local aura of good. So he's going to be a bit happier than all the others. He's going to be happier than all these miners and things. Now, ideally, you'd have a great big grid dug out and you just go, duh, 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 and you do what you like with it. That would be the ideal. That would be the dream. <laughs> but alas, it doesn't really work like that. Uh, okay, let's drop that ladder down to there. That's good. Oh, okay, yeah, that's not really working very well over there, is it? Uh, okay, we've got some soldiers. Let's get another soldier on board. Three soldiers. So we, I think it takes two soldiers to to man one of the towers. So I think we'll have a couple of soldiers. That's good. Right, what's that square there? That is diggable. Right, these guys are trapped now because they've got themselves stuck. <laughs> so I'm going to put in uh, a ladder just there so they can get up. So they can get up to there. Why is that so they can't get back down? There is a ladder there. Oh, no, because they've not dug this tile out yet. There we go. So now they can get back down. Okay. We now need to get ourselves some uh, provision for food. Because people are going to be hungry. And hungry people are grumpy people. And I can testify to this. I get the hangers. So we need to dig this out, I think, a little bit more. Dig that out like that, if we can. If it lets us. It might well not let us. It might not let us do that. Ideally, we want another soldier. Can we get another soldier in? Oh, we could possibly drop a soldier in just there. That would be ideal. Now, can we hire the soldier? Oh, yes, we can. With a tiny... Oh, no. 519. Ah, it goes up the more you have. I didn't know that. There we go. I've learned something. They are mining some gold out, though, down here. So that will help, eventually. Uh, you can push the time forward if you want to. You can do it at four speed if that's so. If that's what you want. There we go. So they've done that. They're going to come and dig this out now, which is lovely. And then we'll sort the ladders out again. We'll sort of try and figure out where the ladders are uh, best placed. Um, so yeah, they need to do that. Oh, now we can hire another soldier. So 519. Lovely. Get you in. So we've got four soldiers. So now we can man this thing properly. We can have two on this thing, two on this thing. We should be okay now for defense of day one. Because very soon... It's going to go into defense mode. There we go. Big flashy thing in corner equals oh, night time. So that's the moon. <laughs> that's the moon. The moon is going to come out very soon. The moon is soon. So yes, we want to make sure that we are ready. We've got four soldiers. That's good. Now, they're not very good soldiers at the minute. They're not very well trained soldiers. So we're going to have to go through and train them. Ah, now that's not ideal, is it? That is a bit rubbish. They've got to go all the way over there to go up on the ladder. Yeah, that's not ideal. We want them to kind of come up here. Okay, and there you go. Look, so they've popped two soldiers on each of the little turret things. And they are waiting for the alien menace to emerge. So let's wait and see. Now, I think probably the first wave is probably fine. Ah, now my people are stuck down here because they are idiots. There we go. Splendid. Let's do that, that and that. And then get rid of that lift uh, uh, ladder just there. So we've got all this to play with. That's absolutely fine. Right, look, there come the aliens. That's an alien. I mean, it looks like a balloon, but it's an alien, all right? That's a terrifying alien beast. Just imagine it's got gnashy teeth and it's not, it doesn't, look, it doesn't just look like a nice balloon. So now if you zoom in, this guy's got a heart on him. He's taken some damage. So this person here is damaged. Now they just bombed our ship. Look, it's gone down to 5,900 out of 6,000 health, which is bad. So we've already taken some damage. Come on, blow them up, blow them up, blow them up, blow them up. They've shot us again. Now, yeah, these guys over here, are only got the, they've only got a slower nature, haven't they? These guys only slow them down. They don't actually shoot them. 
That is probably a bit of a flaw in my plan there. Yeah, these guys only slow them down. That's not good. That's not useful at all. Oh, no, there's two coming from this side. Yeah, we all we do is slow them down these, shoot at them. Yeah, okay, that's a massive problem from me. Okay, we'll have to rectify this. We shall have to. We've got some money. Oh, they just keep on coming from this side. Ah, shoot it. Ah, oh, dearie me. Right, please become data. Right, good. So now the sun's going to come up. Right, okay, okay. That could have gone better. That could have gone a little bit better, I shall be perfectly honest. Right, now we need some food. We need food because nowhere's got any food. Also, we're going to need some toilets. Now, this bit over here could be where the toilets go. We could put several toilets over here. That would be a good thing. Now, toilets do have this negative sort of uh, range, if you like. Is there any way you can find out how far it is? A negative local aura impact. I assume it's the same as the reactor. It has a sort of two squares of negative aura. So if I put a toilet there, yes, there we go. And then a toilet there, that's a couple of toilet blocks that are going to sit there and just just be unpleasant and it's absolutely fine. It doesn't really matter. We're not really too bothered. They can just sit in there and look smelly. Right, here, reactor. Drop another reactor in. Can I not afford a reactor? Oh no, it's 2,000. Oh yes, I haven't got enough of that. We need to get down here. We need to get digging for this here. So do that first. Digger guys, come out and do that. That'd be useful. Uh, and do that actually, dig those three. Now look, they're all running to the toilets. <laughs> They've put some toilets in, praise be. So now we have farms. So there is a farm just here, food stage one. Chefs grow food here, then it's taken to the kitchen. Then there's a kitchen where they cook the food and there's a dining room where they serve the food or a canteen. That's where they serve the food, all by a chef. So we need to make sure we've got the right amount of things in. Now, kitchens have a negative impact again bit weird but we'll drop the negative impact buildings there so it doesn't really matter the farms can go underneath and then we shall have a canteen oh no we can't afford the canteen it's 1200 you need to dig out this gold please <laughs> this is going to keep us going for a bit thank you very much so yeah gold 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 if i dig out those gold bits first and then tunnel downwards that's absolutely fine do those bits as well actually there we go dig 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 oh no there's a solid bit that we can't get through okay so now we've got that drop a canteen in and then we need to get ourselves a chef so we can do that and we can hire a chef now there's not enough power we need more we need more per captain right we still haven't got enough we need 2000 they can dig downwards which is fortunate so come down do some digging give us some stuff please we need 2000 we need more power and then i'll sort ladders out for you guys because you're all trapped at the minute which is a bit rubbish at least the farms are working which is good uh so yes Hires a chef. Oh, no, it's already a chef. Okay. Oh, no, it's power. That was it. I'm distracted. Okay. Let's drop that in. Reactor. Lovely. So we've got another reactor in place. Oh, this is a terrible location. This is terrible. Okay. We need more gold. We need to get more gold. So we need more ladders. Now, these guys here could come and dig some more gold out. They're working on gold right now. We have to put ladders in so they can get out, <laughs> which is not ideal. Oh, that is. this is rubbish. This is a, a rubbishy, rubbishy place. Okay, and like that. So they can get up to that floor. And then possibly like that. And we can take that out. So they can get onto that floor. They can get onto that floor, can't they? Oh no, they've got a ladder up. Let's do that then, like that. So now they should be sorted. They should be able to get up back onto these floors, which is fine. Now these are pretty useless. These are not the best tiles to have available. I suppose we could stick some soldiers down here, possibly. Maybe stick another hospital under here. That might be a good idea. But nothing we need really right now is one of these. We Oh, yes, definitely. Yeah, we need one of these. We need a shooty thing. I can't afford a shooty thing. Okay, that's not good. Do we get any... Hang on, pause, 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 pause. Do we get any money back? 125. That's not enough money. Right, pause, 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 pause. Thank you. Don't bother digging that or that or that or that or that. Get the gold. I need that gold. I need the gold right now. If you could be so kind. If you could hurry up and just dig this tile really quickly before the night time comes. We need some gold. Goldy, goldy, gold. Dig, dig, dig. And just there as well, please. Drop down and dig. Uh, 2,188. Splendid. Right. Get us a blaster. Bullets in five directions. Anything. Just something to shoot. Oh, no. The miner is unhappy. Why? Why are you unhappy? Um, hunger. Ah, well, yes. That, that probably is a problem. But there's food down here. There's food here. You could get food. That's fine. Health is good. Happiness is good. Bladder is good. Yeah, hunger is quite high. Hunger is fairly high. Yeah, you've got... There's space here. There's food just here. You could always come and get some food from the canteen. But okay, that's fine. Oh, the miners are stuck over here, aren't they? 
I've kind of trapped them over here. Of course, that is what the problem is. Okie dokie, right. So they need to get out. They're stuck. Then miners are trapped on that floor. Right, now they can get out and they'll probably go and get themselves some food because they are likely to leave. Right, we've manned the... Oh no. They're not doing the right thing. They're not manning that thing. So we're going to take more damage this side. If anything comes over from this side, we are going to lose. We're going to lose. No, let's... Oh, it was probably very expensive. Is that all you get? 125. And it costs 3,000 to build. Could we get at absolute emergency level that done? Get ourselves another person. Oh, there. There. That's good gold. That's nice, easy gold. So we could just do with another soldier. And he can go out and stand on this and man that and shoot at people. I kind of don't want them to be in there. Can we tell them to go over there? <laughs> Go and do this one. It's more important because this one actually shoots. That just slows them down and there's nothing to shoot at them and the things taking damage. This is bad. This is bad, 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 bad. All kinds of bad. Uh, okay, yeah, this thing's just going to take damage then. This thing is just going to keep being damaged. We've got no method of shooting at them. We've got no way of fighting back. Oh, no. That was a silly mistake. There we go. Never mind. You, you live and learn. You live and learn. Right, they need to dig along here really fast. I need to dig along here very, very quick. I realize we haven't got any cleaners. We have no cleaners on site. So that's going to make people a bit angry as well. Yeah, we just need some more. Oh, look at it. We're losing so much stuff every single time. Dig into this gold thing. Dig, dig, dig. Right, we might just go on a bit of a gold search next time. They're stuck again. Yes, all right. Drop that in. Okay, a quarters. Shall we drop some soldiers in over here, possibly? So we can have soldiers like that. That might work couple of groups of soldiers. Then we could put some nice things there. We could put one of the park things there. Let's do that. Put a soldier in. Okay, that's good news because he can then run up. Oh no, oh no, it's daytime already. Okay, lovely. Right, that was fine. So we took a mm, bit of a beating, I'll be honest. A bit of a beating, but I think it's fine. Okay, your bladder and hunger are quite high. Maybe you should just like yeah, go and chill out. Go and relax or something. There's food. Lots of nice food everywhere in the farms. The farms are doing their thing. There's two kitchens. We should be making lots of stuff. And there's a canteen. Maybe we need another chef, possibly. Maybe we need some more chefs or something. I think that's what they're complaining about. And, um, right, when we get some gold, another thing we're going to do is we're going to work out where all of these sort of uh, impenetrable blocks are. We need to figure out where they are. Because then we can start planning our base a bit better. At the minute, we're kind of doing it a bit random. It's a bit it's a ragtag randomness going on. So yeah, we need to plan it a bit better. We could fit something just there. What can we put there? And our grinder is going to be useful. Generates 300 gold per broken enemy, but has a negative local aura impact. Could we just drop that on there? Oh, it's, oh how much is it? 750. I have no gold at all. I have hardly any gold. Ah, oh, dearie me. Okay, right. Maybe medium wasn't the best choice. Okay. No, we're fine. Look how quickly it is. It's already halfway through the day. It's already halfway through. We've hardly done anything. The days are going by very quickly. 744. That's rubbish. Okay, so we can't mine just there. So we're going to have to go down another level, are we? And across, we're going to need to get to these or this here. We said a massive block of gold. I mean, that'd be very useful. That'd be so useful. <laughs> Could we just get that? Uh, okay, let's put another one of these in. Drop another one there. Can we get ourselves a soldier? Five, seven, one. No, we need some more gold. Yeah, they're on it here. This is good, 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 good. More gold, more gold, more gold. Gold is good. We need more gold. Uh, yeah, if you could just dig this out, that'd be splendid. So only three people can dig at the same time. Right, okay. Is that enough to get a soldier? Yes, it is. Okay, I think we'll be all right. I think we'll be okay. Two shooty things and a slowy down thing. That's quite useful. And that's the official terminology. That's coming around very, very quickly. That is a bit terrifying. <laughs> That's come around so fast. We've got no monies. We've got no monies. So yeah, we could do with going down here. We really need to tunnel down here somewhere. I wonder if we can just go like that. Just go dig, 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 dig. Dig all of this, please. There we go. And right, night time has come. Oh, dearie me. Right, okay. Everyone line up. Six people. Two people on the shooty thing. Two people on the other shooty thing. Two people on the slowy downy thing. This is going to be good. We're going to be fine. I think we're going to be absolutely fine with this. Right, hurry time on because we can't redo really much. We don't redo really much. Yes, that's better. So it's on 4880, 48554655555. Yeah, that didn't go too well, did it? Another onslaught's going to combine a minute, is it? Is that it? Is that all they're going to throw at us? 
Ah, pah, rubbishy aliens. Okay, now they've dug all the way along there. They're claiming that they're stuck. Where are they trying to go? Yeah, I don't want you to do that. We'll put a ladder in just here. That's absolutely fine. Oh, that's freed you up. Okay, that's a bit weird, but okie doke, right you are. Uh, we can put along here. So that's pretty good. We'll take that. Now these guys are going to come down here, are they? This poor person's digging all on their own. <laughs> oh, that's a bit sad. So we've got 4,000 gold. 4,000 gold is good. So let's build ourselves a tower just here. And on this tower, we are going to put on a radar. On this tower, we are not going to put on a radar quite yet. We need some more gold. Once we've dug a few of these out, we'll be able to put a radar on. That's fine. Uh, it's also telling me that I've got injured patients and I should build a hospital. Also, we need a cleaner. Those toilets are revolting. The toilets are horrible. So let's drop a cleaner in. Uh, let's drop a cleaner in down here. I don't think it particularly matters whereabouts the cleaners go. So let's just put a cleaner just there. That's fine. They are green. Look, there we go. So if you could just hurry up and do some digging along here, that'd be aces. If you could just you know, get on with the get on with the digging there. Come and help this person out because they're all on their own. Where's everyone else gone? Oh, they're going to the toilets. Okay, that's fine. And he's cleaning the toilets. Lovely. Well done. And he's cleaning the hospital as well. The hospital's got a bit of a a bit of a, a fug around it. That's unpleasant, isn't it? Ugh. What's been going on in the hospital? But um, yeah, it's making people ill. It's affecting people. So the little heart means that they're a bit poorly. A soldier has died in battle. Really? Are you sure? Two soldiers are dead, are they? Did we lose two soldiers? Give over. No. We never did. Well, we need to get them back. That's annoying. That's taken up some of my monies that I wanted. Um, and we've still got four miners, although I don't quite know where they are. Where are the rest of the miners? There's two digging there. There's one there. Where is our other miner? Just sort of chilling out somewhere, are they? Just sitting about? Are you in the loo or something? We could do with another cleaner, really. Um, okay, they're going into the canteen for food. Food is looking okay. Let's just go through and check. Minor, hunger 28%. Room messiness is fine. Everything like that is fine. Bladder, bladder's a bit of a problem. Do you know what? We could put a toilet just there because it only affects this floor. It doesn't really matter. So we can come along and just go, yay, there's a toilet just there. Lovely. Next to the kitchens. <laughs> That's nice. Um, okay, it's telling me to build another hospital as well. I've already got a hospital and they're prohibitively expensive. They're 3,000. I can't afford a hospital right now. We could go to those. Get ourselves a permanent, permanent source of money, which would be useful. Uh, we also need to defend from the thing. We also can't do that because I didn't get four and a half grand, which is annoying, and I wanted to get four and a half grand to do the thing. Um, we've only got five. Are we another soldier down? Did we lose another soldier? Right, come on, soldier. Come on. Get over here and do some stuff, please. Right, we need another hospital. That's what we need next. Oh, we, I want to buy the scanner thing. Right, he's in the big, rich vein of gold. That is beautiful. So what we'll do is we'll just do this. We'll do it so that he can get out. Or whoever you are can get out. So we'll do that, 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 there. So that's fine. You should be able to get out from there. So you should be able to cover all these floors, do lots of digging. You guys are stuck because you're idiots. Uh, yeah, a little ladder thing there. That's fine. <laughs> Go and help this person down here. Go and help them. They've got so much digging to do. But now they're going to get out. They're going to have a little sit down, I imagine. How are we doing? 3,780. Oh, dear. That's not very good. That is not good at all. That is not as high as I wanted it to be. Um, we, yeah, we need another hospital. We need another hospital. So we need 3,000 for the hospital. We're going to need to power the hospital. So we're going to need a reactor, which is 2,000. A worker has quit because they were too hungry, but they couldn't eat. Really? The canteen's just here. Full of food. It's full of food. Fine, we'll hire a new miner then. This one's probably going to leave as well because they are... Uh, hungry. Well, go, the canteen is just here. Just go to the canteen and eat something, would you please? Right. Daytime. Daytime is on its way. You are digging out much in the way of gold down here, which is splendid news. So we need to hurry time on, really. We need to dig a few more of these tiles out. And then, yeah, times four, time five thousand. Let's get six and a half thousand gold. That's lovely. Right. Now we can get ourselves a hospital like that with... Uh, a office next to it, which we can put a doctor in. So now I've got two hospitals. We're going to need some more power, so let's drop a reactor in. Lovely. Right, it's all looking sort of fine. We want one of these now, a grinder. 
to turn uh, broken enemies, so broken alien spaceships, into money, which is very good. So it's 750 from the off. It's got a negative aura impact thingy about it as well, which is not ideal. So what we could do is, on this floor here, this is a bit of a rubbishy floor, if we dig that tile out as well, if we go, all right, put a... Uh, yeah, if we set the grinder on the end there, that'd be useful. Are you going to come up and help me with that, or are you not going to help me with that? Are you coming up to do this digging just here? No, you flipping well are not. Um, okay. Oh, no, someone is. Someone has been tasked to do it. Look. Yes. Come and do the digging, please. Up to four speed. There we go. Lovely. Dig, 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 dig. Right, okay. Back to one. So put the grinder thing just there. That's good. And then no one cares. It can just sit there and just be unpleasant. And no one can no one can give a monkeys about it. It's absolutely fine. And then we could put ourselves a generator for 2,000. And then we could put just here some toilets like so. And that floor, no one needs to care about. No one needs to give a monkeys about that. We might as well also drop a farm into there. That's very good. And that's all sorted. Now we can dig that tile out. I don't know why we haven't yet. Why don't we dig that tile out? I'm not entirely sure. Uh, right, then we need to get these out. These gold tiles need to go. Once we've dug those out, it's night time. We're probably fighting aliens at the minute, aren't we? I should possibly do something about that. Now, another thing I do need to do is I need to train our soldiers. I need to train the soldiers because the soldiers need to be trained. Oh, no, that's going to shoot at us. Stop, stop. Just shoot it more. Shoot it more. You're not shooting it enough. Shoot more things. 3,305 and the soldiers are dropping. We need more soldiers. We really need more soldiers. We need more soldiers and we need a training facility. So let's put the training facility just here. And then let's get ourselves a massive load of soldiers. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And let's see how many soldiers we can get right now. So that's 691, that's some, that's some, that's some. And right, we can't afford any more. Four more soldiers going to our defense. That is beautiful. We definitely need that. We definitely need that. Right, they've dug all that gold out. That gold did not last long, did it? That did not last long at all. Right, let's go round that way and dig that out. And also dig that out. Lovely, lovely. That's fine. We'll dig all those things out. And then we're going to want to go up here as well. Now, I don't quite know how this is going to work up here. But there we go. Let's try that for now. Go like that and see if that works. And then we can get to these infinite gold things, which will be lovely. And the next thing we might do is go and get that. Maybe we just go down here, follow that path along, and just dig all that out. And that'll give us a lot of resource. <laughs> that'll give us a lot of stuff. Right, the training thing. We've got a training center for our uh, for our soldiers. It makes them better, because I suspect that we've got a problem that our soldiers are not very good. Now, we do need some money. We need some gold, because we need people to get paid. Because otherwise people are going to be cross if they don't get paid any money. So that's going to make people sad. I don't want sad people. I want happy, happy people. Um, these white lines on the farm show how much stuff there is in the farm. So when so there's that much food, if you like, in the farm. That much food in that one. And then sort of, what, a quarter full, maybe a third-ish full in that one. The health of your rocket is low. I know. I know. And I can't do anything about it. I need to build some more things. But I need some more gold. 250 for a turrety thingy. Uh, put one there. Can we build anything on it? We got anything that's half decent? We could do with a griller, really. We could do with 8,000 monies. 8,000 monies. That would be good. Hang on. That just sped the day through there very quickly. Did that speed time on really quickly? Oh, is that a little bit of a bug? Is that a bit of a bug? I Ah, now. Now, what I was doing was I was pressing shift and moving the... Uh, moving the screen around using uh, WASD and it seemed to speed the time of day forward. Now I didn't see if it did loads of other stuff as well. Oh, 5,000. Can we get anything? Another blaster. That's rubbish. We need a gorilla or a bomber. Um, yeah, we need those. However, right, the training thing. They get they train in this and then they can use these things better. So they can shoot better just normally. So we're going to have people who just sort of stood about on the surface now, if you look. There you go. They're sort of more roving soldiers that can just wander about and take pot shots. But um, they can use the uh, facilities better as well. This is shooty things. You can use those nicer. So, uh, yeah, that's a good thing. Let's just drop a park in there while we can. Uh, let's drop a park just there. Try and drop parks where we can because we can't use that space for anything else. So we'll drop a park down there and a park down there. Why the heck not? And then we just need to save up for 8,000. We need another cleaner, possibly. It'd be good if we could dig those three tiles out as well. Oh, they're all stuck. They're all stuck because you're all wallies. 
Right, go on, back up you go. Yeah, up the middle. <laughs> You've got the gold out, that's fine. So, um, ah, good, get more gold. More gold, we need 8,000. Give us 8,000 gold, come on. Come on, yes, 8,000 gold is lovely. This here, a gorilla. Oh no, it's gone below 8,000 again <laughs> because we're paying people money. Oh, you and your wages. Do you want to survive? Clearly not. Uh, okay, we might need to get some more gold before we upgrade anything because otherwise we can't pay people and people will be angry and people will leave and that's bad. We also need some more food provision as well. But we really need to keep the rocket alive. 775 health on that rocket. That is rubbish. So we need to buy ourselves a gorilla. Rapidly shoots fireballs, cannot hit shielded enemies. That's splendid. That's splendid. Now what I did want to get, I wanted to get a radar. Because the radar shows you the whole... The whole of the, the uh, sort of uh, working area, if you like. So you can see where these blocks are. And you can see where you can sort of uh, tunnel into. So you've got an idea of what you need to do and where you can go. But unfortunately, uh, I'm probably not going to get one of those. Because I think next time I might be done. <laughs> I think next time might be the end. Because I'm not doing very well. I don't know if you've noticed. It's not going particularly well. Um, okay, now how can we get up there? We want to kind of go that way then. Because that way is a bit blocked off now. How can we get up that way? Don't tell me that's all blocked off. That'd be really annoying. Right. 8,281. Get a gorilla. Yes. Right. Fireball shooter. That should be useful. That should be quite handy, shouldn't it? I would have thought. And how much is another blaster? 2,000. So I'd need 2,250 to get anything else. I'm not going to get that before the next day, am I? Ah, that's annoying. Okay. Let's sort of try and just do that. Like that. Then mine those, please. Yeah, okay. Uh, you guys aren't stuck. Oh, no, there you go. You're fine. Okay, so you're going up here. The soldiers are training. Now, that's good. Soldiers are training. Everyone kind of looks okay in terms of happiness. The, the couple of miners. This miner here's got a bit of a wibbly face. And he's got a sad face. Why is he sad? He's hungry and he's sleepy. Okay. Maybe I need to stop giving them stuff to do. But that is your job. If you're tired, go home and have a nap. Not your mum. Go and do it yourself. <laughs> Come on. Use your brain. Uh, also, we can drop a little um, park dome thing there to make that guy happy. That's lovely. Uh, okay. We've got a floor here. for We could put a cleaner on there. A soldier's increased a level in training. We could put a training room in for 1800 We couldn't put a training room in for 1800 because we haven't got the money. Okay. I suspect this might be it. This might be the end of our game. The great beyond is not going to be within our reach because I think we are going to be did. We're going to be killed very shortly. But we've got some level two soldiers. They've got a two on them, which is lovely. I'll get out to the gorilla thing. Come on. Come on. Pow, pow, pow. Yes. Oh, that thing is tremendous. Okay, that's very good. Yeah. Bang, 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 bang. Yes. Okay, that's working. And the mobile soldiers on the top are very good because they can run out and take pot shots as well. Look, bang, 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 bang. Yes. Okay. It's not taking any damage. It's taking no damage. We could do this. We could do that. I thought this was going to be it. Now, our soldiers are taking damage. They are being hurt. Oh, no, there's triangle ones, and they change shape. They change shape. It's going to get us. Oh, no, that caused 100 points of damage. There's a lot of them. 500, 360. No, no, maybe I spoke too soon. Maybe I spoke too soon. Oh, thank goodness. Some of them came back up from the hospital. Some of them came back up. Oh, 60. One more hit, and we're gone. One more hit, and we are out of here. I don't think we can do any more than this. Oh, no. Oh, no. There's loads of them coming in. No, no, no. Oh, and it's it's all over. Oh, no. Oh, that's a shame. I accept my... <laughs> that's a nice touch. I accept my defeat. Damn it. Yeah, I completely agree. Damn it. Just because I want to, I'm going to go on easy mode and just quickly play it through. So you won't see me doing all of it. I'll come back for, you know, particular highlights where I'll go, right, I've mined out a new area. Or I've put a load of soldier bases in. Or, you know, I've my rockets down to half health or whatever. I'm going to go on easy mode. Let's just see what the difference is between easy mode and medium mode. Now, I dread to think what hard mode is. I don't quite know how the difficulty is calculated. I'm going to guess two things. Well, maybe three things. Uh, one is probably the amount of resource you get from a gold block. I guess you might get less gold on the hard mode than you do the other ones. Um, um, probably the enemies are harder to kill, I would imagine, on uh, the higher levels. And um, probably it's harder to keep your people in check. So, you know, your people's hunger and um, sadness and whatever will go up higher. So it's hard to keep you know, manage your folks. But okay, yeah, I'm going to do an easy game. Let's just have a look. So we'll have a look what we start with. Okay, so we start with... Oh, no, it's not the same as before. It's not quite the same as before. But yeah, we can manage this. Okay, 
big thing there. Oh, and look, the, the special blocks are absolutely miles away. They're so far away. And there is not a big block of gold like we did before over here. There was like a massive blob of gold. There is not that there now. Yeah. Okay, fine. Right, so let's give this a go then. Let's see if we can do this any better. So yeah, we'll zone this bit out. We'll get that bit done. And we'll go all the way over there like that. And we'll go all the way over there like that, if we can. Okay, so yeah, I'm going to play this. We'll see how we get on. I'll come back and report back on interesting, important things. Do we start with a bit more money on easy mode? I can't remember what we started with. I think we might start with a bit more money as well, possibly. I can't quite recall, but okie dokie. Right, so yeah, let's give this a go. Okay, so I've survived night one and the location of this and so the general sort of layout of the base with the sort of uh, unpenetrable blocks, if you like, is far better. It's far easier than the other one, the other level that we just tried. There's loads of room. Look, there's just acres of space. You can just build all sorts of things. So I went crazy for miners. We've got loads of miners. So I thought digging stuff out is important. We need to dig stuff out very quickly. We've got ourselves four soldiers at the minute. They did an okay job. The thing did not take any damage last night. And they only had a little sort of blaster station each. So we need to get more soldiers. We need to get a lot more soldiers involved. Because we can need loads of them sort of lining up on the surface. We've got ourselves a grinder in early. We've got plenty of power at the minute. We've got a doctor with a hospital. Next thing we're going to tackle is food. We're going to dig out this possibly if we can. If we can dig all that out. And then I might go straight down. We're going to dig all that out possibly. In fact, let's get that done. Can zone all that out that'd be nice and then try and dig down here as much as we can and just get toward these and just get infinite stuff and we'll just go yes yeah, right we just build some uh, some miners down here uh, and then just literally they can just go and just mine that and we'll put food down here we'll put everything down here they need and they can just work on that they can work on that all the time and just bring in constant scores of cash which would be lovely but right now we need to get there first so what i'm going to do is as well i didn't get to show you this last time I'm going to drop one of those things just there. Yes, it's got no power. And because I've got the money for it now, I'm going to build a radar. Remove the shroud that covers unvisited areas so they appear visible. This is very useful indeed. Bosh. There we go. I can see now what I've got to work with. Oh, getting that thing is an absolute pain. Oh, that's horrible. That's horrible. Oh, it's not as like I can dig straight down. Oh, and all this is a stupid shape as well. Well, let's not dig that out. Let's not dig that out. Oh, okay, right. Well, that's not as ideal as it could be. This is quite nice, though. We'll have all that dug out. Yeah, we'll have all this. Dig all that, folks. That's very good. And then, yeah, getting down to here, then. It might be a case of do that floor and then sink a sort of mine shaft down there and then go from there. Maybe just do all that. That's a bit annoying, isn't it? Let's build some ladders while we're here, while we've got the money. So we've got some monies remaining. There we go. Lovely. Build ladders like that. That should be good. Where do you want to build the ladders along here? Possibly on the edge. There, there, and there, and there. And then along this one, we could build the ladders along the edge just this way. So one there, one there, and one there. And then on that floor, they can going to have to get up. Yeah, let's put one there then. That's fine. Right, so now they've got plenty to do. The miners have got absolutely loads to do. We need some food provision. That's what our next job is, food provision, because we've got nothing to eat. We've got toilets, we've got doctors, we haven't got any food. So yeah, we'll be sorting that out next. Okay, I'm on day nine and I'm still alive. 2,455 health left in the rocket halfway through. And look, it's quite big. We've got this sort of big base going on. And I've dug down to here. I've dug down to here and we're getting the most out of these. I assume they're like gems. Yeah, gems or diamonds or whatever they are. The health of your rocket is low. I know it is. I know we're doing quite well though. We're doing okay. And I might, I might go through and grab all that. Because there's a lot of nice, easy gold just there. Just lovely, nice, simple gold we can get. Yeah, there you go. You can get out now. That's fine. Do sort that thing. Uh, we're zoning this bit out as well. We need some. I still think we need some more soldiers. We need more people. We need more people. We've got them in training. We need some more of these as well. So we need a bit more money so we can build some more of these. We've got a bomber. Uh, shoots powerful bombs at a slow speed. Shoots fast missiles with a level 4 soldier. Well, they're all training. So a bomber might be quite a good thing to put in. So yeah, let's get a bomber. I'd like another one of those if we could. So six grand. Six grand that's going to cost. And I've realised that if you press the shift button, it goes into super ultra mega speed mode. So look, you can just... Nothing's particularly happening. Everything's ticking over quite nicely. We've got ourselves a little area over here for... There's a sort of mini food area just there. So they don't have to go all the way over there. I might possibly put another farm and kitchen and stuff in once we've got this floor dug in another canteen a couple more chefs more soldiers over that bit 
So yeah, look over here. It's ticking over quite nicely. You've got some canteens there, got some cleaners, got a space there. I didn't quite know what to do with that. Do you know what? Just here, I might put a hospital and another doctor in there. We've got one there. He's got two patients. So yeah, we could put a hospital and a doctor in. But yes, if we press the shift button, so I'm pressing left shift, look, it goes proper, proper super fast. Oh my goodness. There's an awful lot of baddies. An awful lot of baddies. And we need something this side. We need something this side. That fireball thing is doing a grand job. Look at it. Maybe because they're level two as well. They are better. Maybe because they're level two, they're better at shooting it down. We get some gold from all the sort of the wreckage and stuff. That's lovely. Okay. Do you know what? Bomber. Yeah, do that. Absolutely. Now the plan, another good plan could be at the end, at the end of those, stick a slow down a Tronator thing on there. Slow the enemies down as they're coming by. So then we can just pick them off. That's quite a good idea. We need money for that, but that's fine. So we've got that one there and that one there. How much are these slower things? The shockers, 3,000. Oh, man. So, yeah, we're going to need quite a bit. So if we hurry the night along, can we get to 3,000? Oh, yes, look at that. So we've sped time through already a lot. So we get a shocker on that side. That's good. Now, yeah, I don't want to do it right now because we can run out of money very easily. Now, people don't get paid and people get very angry. If they're not getting paid, they get a bit miserable, which is weird, isn't it? That's a strange situation. Um, Let's... Put, yeah, let's have a bit on this floor like that. So let's have a couple more soldiers. Uh, we'll do, maybe we'll do that and then have, I know we can have four, four soldiers. Four more soldiers, I think, would be a good idea. So one, two, did I put a thing on there? No. Right, okay, maybe hold off on the soldiers. Get this gold out of the ground. Come on, give me 3,000. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. 3,000, 3,000, 3,000. Just, just give me 3,000. Thank you. Whatever. The, the rest of it can wait. Another shocker up there. Is this going to work then? Is my plan going to work? Are we going to see this thing working? Oh no, there's no one on it. There's no one on the shocker. That is that is an actual shocker. Where is everybody? Where are all the people? There's no one on it. I built a thing specifically with a plan in mind. Right, we're going to need more soldiers. More soldiers than the 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 11. We must have more than that. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6... 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. I should have 12 there. Maybe, ah, maybe they're in the hospital or whatever. Maybe they're injured. Maybe they're injured and aren't able to do stuff. Okay, right. We definitely need more soldiers then. We need more people. More people. Okay, well, we've got some down here. So let's get another two soldiers in at the very least. So that's two more coming in. Um, we've got a training room here. We're going to need some place where there's like toilets and a kitchen and stuff. Right, hang on. We could put a kitchen just there. We could put some toilets next to that. We could stick a park thing just there. And then we could put ourselves some more stuff over here. So we can have one, two, three. Oh, we're running out of power. Right, we can drop one of those into just there. Okay. So we've got more soldiers. Hopefully they can arm the slow down atrons. Yeah, look, it looks like they are. It looks like they are. Oh, you're going all the way to that one. Oh, good job. Yes. Okay, right. And it's daytime. We need more people. <laughs> we just need more people. More bodies. So, uh, yeah, we need to mine out more gold. More gold. Mine out everything. We're literally just going to mine out every single thing. Destroy room unit. No, don't destroy anything. No destroying needs to happen. So, yeah, let's go through and grab all of the gold. All the gold that we can. Every single bit of gold is going to be useful. Because that's it. Once this gold is gone, we're, we're, we're done. We're down relying on those things. On the shiny, pretty things. But, okay, right, let's see what we can do. Ah, right, it was all looking quite well. And then it's gone a bit wrong. It's gone a bit wibbly. A worker has quit because they were too hungry but couldn't eat. Another message said a worker has quit because they couldn't get to the toilet. I don't know quite what people are doing. I'm not stopping them getting to food places. And there's loads of food. There's loads of food around. But it appears that all of our soldiers have left. Which isn't ideal. Because now I think it might be game up. I think the game might be over. I don't think we can afford any more soldiers. And they're all level 1 soldiers. We've got lots of things. We've got lots of armaments. But we're on 1065. Day 13 of 18. I don't think we can do it. We need someone on that. On the slower Tronator. Oh, they're all coming this way. Everyone's sort of loaded up this side. But not that side. Yes, yeah, shoot it. Yes. Okay. We might be okay. We might be okay. Look, things are blowing up. Yeah, we shoot, we're shooting stuff down. Right, let's just press shift. Just press shift, just hurry time along. In fact, can we just do that to three speed? There we go, so we can see what's going on. Oh, no, 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 we're taking damage. The rocket is taking some serious damage. This is not good. More soldiers. We can hire more soldiers. Of course, they're more expensive now. Even though they've left, the price doesn't come down. So to hire a new soldier is very expensive indeed. So, um, yeah, I don't know where the, why they left. 
they can't get to the food or something. But it's like, well, there's plenty of food. There's plenty of kitchens and foods and toilets and all. there's loads of stuff around. So I don't quite know what your problem was. But okie doke. Yeah, they're all up here, look. All the ones that were up here left. And there's toilets just there. Canteens along there. There's ladders. You can get to everything. So I don't really know what the problem was. But okay. So now we're on day 30. We're going to go to day 14. There. Day 14. We've got injured people. That's fine. I think possibly. Do we need some more doctors? Maybe we need to... Uh, we need to drop a couple more doctors in. Oh, that's annoying because they're expensive. But let's do that then. Let's put a doctor over there. Possibly a cleaner as well. That might be useful. Health of my rocket is low. Yes, it is. You are absolutely spot on with that observation. Thank you. Right. I think. Can we do anything else? All the soldiers are in. That's good. A level four soldier. So everybody's kind of, you know, everyone's tooled up. Everyone's in. These guys aren't tooled up. These are level one. These guys are green. These guys are green noobs. They don't know anything. Level four guy. You can show them the way. Uh, down here, the level twos. Level two soldiers. Park domes. So yeah, right. Do you reckon we can get any more soldiers in? If we do that and then drop a nice park between them, that's lovely. Uh, power. We're going to need some more power. That's more important. Let's drop. Well, this floor. We can just have this floor as a... a no in fact, do you know what? We can put the power thing anywhere we like. We can just put that there. There you go. No one need to bother about that ever again. That's absolutely fine. We don't need to care. So, um, yeah, night time's coming round. Get ourselves another soldier. Try and survive. I don't think we're going to do it. I think this might be this might be our record. Day 14. So let's see. All the soldiers pour out onto the surface. We've got extra doctors in place. We've got extra people lying about. So this is good. They're all taking up their positions on the, on the guns. They're going to the slower tron. There's people on the slower tron over there as well. This Okay, this is encouraging. We could do this. We could do we could survive we could survive the night let's watch it through okay this is a little bit slow so let's hurry it up a little bit let's put it on double speed right so it's exploding so oh no they've been hurt on that end they've come off the thing they're not guarding it anymore okay no it's going all right it's going all right we're picking them off we're picking them off come on doctors do your job get everyone back out get everyone back out as soon as you can is there going to be another round another round of baddies yes no i don't know they're going to the slow and though oh this is brilliant uh no that was it Oh, yes, we survived. Okay, right, let's build up for another day then. Okay, so night time is coming around again. Now, I have changed this square here. This was set to be a cleaner, but I've changed it to be a doctor because then he's nearer the hospital so we can go and help people. So that's probably a good idea. Right, we've got some more soldiers. Well, we've got, what, another couple down here. So it's another two, three. In fact, three soldiers down here. So three more people are up here able to possibly... Ah, we've got some sort of, you know, roaming people so they can just shoot them and just run around and fire pistols at them or whatever they've got. So yeah, this is going to be good. This is going to be fine. And then this is good because we've got extras. When people are injured, they can go and get healed in the hospital and then people can take over. The, the uh, loose sort of spare guys can then run in and take over some of the tower things. Yes. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Take them down, take them down, take them down. Yes, beautiful. Take them down. Okay. That's good. Well, that one, that one seems tough. That one seems very tough. This hexagon, uh, not hexagon, pentagon shaped thing seems very tough. Triangles, triangles are easy. Pentagons are tough. Then it turns into that, then into triangle, then into a sort of wibbly shape. Okay, right. I hadn't noticed that. Actually. I hadn't noticed that they changed shape, if I'm completely honest. Right, we get lots of money out of them as well. The grinder thing is giving us money. Okay, is that it? Is that it? Okay, right, run forward to day, day 16. Day 16. Could, could we do this? Could we possibly do this? Now, I'm a little bit wary now of spending all the money we've got. I don't really want to spend all the money we've got because then uh, I can keep people because they're going to have wages and stuff. So let's spend a little bit more. Let's get more soldiers. Soldiers are going to be important. We've got a canteen. Maybe we get another chef. Possibly put more chefs and a cleaner in down here. Might be useful. Uh, cleaner. We need a little bit more power. Do you know what? Yeah, that floor as well. Whatever. Don't really care where it is in the base now. Um, a cleaner and a chef. So the chef can go up here. There's a kitchen here. There's some farms here. In fact, these farms are full. Where's that chef going? Where is this, this stuff just here? Right here. Farms, full farms just here. And a canteen and a farm there. They're all full. And there's a kitchen right there. What are you doing? Where are you going? Okay, fine. What if we put another chef in to make sure everyone can eat? Where are you going to go? Okay, that's a bit weird. Oh, no, you're going over here. You're going to this farm, hopefully. Okay, that's good. Right, go to that farm. That is fine. Right, is everything looking good? Everything's looking fine. That is empty. Can we put something on that? A blaster. Just stick a blaster on it just to get more shots at them as they come by. Yeah, why the heck not? Let's do that on this side as well. Just anything. Literally just, just shoot at them. Just bang, bang, bang. There we go. It's another thing that can fire at things. That's probably good. Okay, everyone's happy. 
Everyone's got a happy face. There's no red doors. No red front doors anywhere. That's a good thing. I think we could possibly do it. We could possibly do this. We've got some level 4 soldiers. We've got some level 3 soldiers. There's a level 4 over there. Right. Shoot these things. That slowed it down, but there's nobody else to shoot at it. So it's going slowly, but it's not being picked off. Right, okay, yeah, there we go. Bang, 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 bang. Lots of stuff exploding. Oh, there's loads of them. There's loads of aliens. Loads of alien menace. Oh, no. <laughs> They're getting very, very near. This thing is entirely unmanned. Get onto this, somebody. Get onto it and shoot things. Yes. Okay. You're injured. You're injured. You're injured. You're injured. But I think we can do it. I think we can do it. We've got two... A soldier has died. Oh, no. That's not... No, 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 no. That thing's going to get us. 137. 137. It's probably because we lost somebody. It's probably because we lost somebody. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, I think we're going to... No, I don't think it's going to work. I don't think it's going to work. I think these are going to be too strong. There's two hexagon-shaped things coming. Yes, we took that one down. Boom, 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 boom. Right, good. Another one, another one. Pick it off, pick it off, pick it off. More, 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 more. Yeah, this is good. I keep going from phases of, yes, we're going to do it, to, oh, no, all hope is lost. And then back we go to, yes, we can do it again. So we've got a couple of nights to survive. Yeah, there we go. We just need... I don't know, like five more soldiers, maybe even ten more soldiers. Just ramp up the... Don't go in! There's aliens! Uh, what? Okay. Well, that was a bit rubbish. That was a, that was, that was a disappointing end to that. Because there were aliens flying overhead and all my soldiers came in because the sun was coming out. Even though we were still being attacked. Hmm... Okay, well, I'll, I'll take... Uh, do you know what? I'm going to take that as a victory. I accept... Do you know what? That's annoying. I accept my defeat. No, why do you not accept my defeat? Uh, that, that's possibly a little bug, possibly. Because it's definitely nighttime. It's definitely dark. And there are definitely aliens still flying overhead. So if my soldiers are just going, Ah, it's fine. I'm going in now. When we're being attacked by aliens and we're destroying the very thing we're seeking to protect, that seems a little bit silly. That seems a little bit silly. But... Oh, do you know what? Never mind. I accept my defeat. I'm going to accept it ungraciously because I'm grumpy about it. Because I, th I think we had that. I think we had that in the bag. Two more nights. We could have survived that. But there we go. Damn it. But yes, The Great Beyond. That is a fantastic little game. And it's free. And it's on It's on itch. And it's lovely. And I enjoyed every minute. Apart from maybe that end bit was a little bit known. But it, it's good fun. It's nice and simple. It's not complicated. I mean, it's free, which is always a good thing anyway. And um, yeah, it's very, very enjoyable. And it's very, very challenging. I mean, that was easy mode. That was easy mode, and I've got this sort of giant sprawling base, and I've got, I mean, I had quite a lot of gold. I had quite a lot of gold. I mean, I could have bought a lot more people. Really, maybe I should have bought a load of people. But still, that wouldn't have affected that, would it? Those spaceships still would have been flying around at night time, and my guys would have just given up and gone to bed. So, um, yeah, I possibly could have done something. But yeah, it's nice and simple. There's no complicated mechanics of you need certain things to build this and certain things to build that. You just get gold, you build buildings, you put people in the buildings, and then the soldiers go up at night time and shoot stuff. And that's it. It's very, very good. So, yeah, I enjoyed that a lot. So, um, yes, I, I was made aware of it, actually, by, I, th I assume, Michael Barrigo Borrego himself emailing me a long while ago now. And I must apologise for taking quite so long to get round to playing it. But I'm, uh, I'm glad I did. I'm glad I did. Because that was a lot of fun. That was a lot of fun. So, yes, The Great Beyond. Link to the Itch page is in the video description if you want to go and check it out. It's free. And, uh, yeah, it, it's really rather splendid. So, yes, if you did enjoy that as much as I did, because I enjoyed that an awful lot. That was a great fun hour and a half-ish of games. Gaming. I enjoyed myself an awful lot. If you did, please do leave a like and also please do subscribe to keep up to date with all the other stuff that we get up to as well. But for now, thank you very much for joining me in the Geek Cupboard and I will see you next time. He's gone down the lift sooner they're not built. The lifts aren't finished. People, people, this is very dangerous. Martin said it's fine and gave me a negative review. You silly man, Martin. You've clicked the wrong button. It looked like he had no trousers on, which was a little bit strange. Oh, Linda, with your gleaming golden words of appreciation. Linda says, eh, okay, hotel. <laughs>